Yeah. Um, you know, I was thinking about it today because I was in, I know how much hard work went into everybody put into this, you know, administration, you know, um, from Dr. Creed, Hannah, um, Justin, everybody put in so much. Matt, um, I was thinking about the old J.A. Campbell, um, sort of the, the tale of when, when Bowie's Creek Academy burned down and he was kind of in the, um, the doldrums of what to do next. Um, and then, the, you know, that's where it came, like, you get a hump on your back, you got work to do, and they rebuilt, rebuilt the school, and, and here we are. And I just kept thinking, like, the effort and energy that was given to trying to make this special for us embodied that so perfectly. Um, the crowd was amazing, students, uh, all, my, all the coaches that got their teams here for me, uh, for us, it was, it was incredible. Um, you know, obviously, national TV is is, is an exciting part of it, but that can be our atmosphere on any given night. Um, you know, even when we don't have sandwiches to give out or what have you. But our, our um, I'm just so happy for for everybody that 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 occurred in our arena. And your team formed up to the bigger level of the crowd. I, I, I thought it was a I thought it was a great game. Your initial thoughts on that? Personally? Yeah, I mean, I, I thought we played with great energy. Um, you know, I think our, our second half focus was really pinpoint short of a couple turnovers against the zone late when it was a lead. I thought we really handled things incredibly well. Um, there was poise. It looked We looked confident. We looked like a team that knew we were supposed to win that basketball game, and we executed that. Um, you know, obviously, Delhi was terrific. Um, I shouldn't say obviously, that, that, that's like unfair. It doesn't give him his due. He played an incredible game, so poised. And, you know, what you're starting to see in, in some of these games where we've really played well is you're starting to see him like evolve as a like orchestrator. You know, William and Mary was that way, you know, Hofstra, you know, starting to like just know how to control the entire game. Even if he doesn't have the ball in his hands, he kind of knows. and. And the other guys are starting to figure out how to play off him with that. Um, but yeah, we got we got really good contributions um, from a lot of guys. I mean, I felt like you reminded me of that play. I mean, that play at the end when Jason die, lays out to like basically end the game is like everything you could ever ask for. Um, you know, other than the converted layup, it was it was incredible. And but it took what all those seconds off the clock, and that's what it's all about, you know. Ball's on the floor, and you're the first one to it. Something good's going to happen for your team. Um, I, was, I was really, really impressed with our group today. Somebody that stood out to me specifically played his first game today, Omar Harris. Talk about, like, you know, I kept seeing on-ball defense and just unbelievable effort from him, Yeah. especially effective in the trap. Talk about his impact and what it means to have him out there. Yeah, he's, um, you know, he's been really good in practice, um, and – and we just thought maybe he could give us a little something. Um, defensively, he's really, really good on the ball. Has a pretty good understanding. So this week we kind of tried him with the first and second group a good amount to make sure like the knowledge level was up enough because he's been on the scout team. And um, you know he produced. He, he played really well. Um, I had a big steal. I think. Um, I think he had an assist. And then obviously that that lefty floater was incredible. I think he's tried that shot before, but I'm not positive. <laughs> Elon went heavily to a 2-3 zone there in the middle of the second half. How do you feel like the offense attacked it? It seemed like it was something that you, you continuously, they kept going to it, they kept coming off of it, kept going off back to it. Does it feel like something that was really going to throw you guys off? How do you think you prepared for that? Uh, I mean, we did two full days of it. They, they played 2-3 in every game. Uh, I wasn't expecting a wire-to-wire, -wire, even when down. Uh, game where they were, I thought they would go to man at some point, but they did not. Um, but I thought early we did a really good job, like Delhi did a good job of getting the ball in the middle, um, Delhi LV, like they were, they were real, we did a good job attacking it early uh, on the interior and on the baseline, and we just missed a lot of threes in the first half that were actually pretty good shots. And that's what I told them at halftime is like, we're getting good shots, just keep going. We tried a few things different, but not a lot. 
it was more like make good passes, you know, take care of the ball, make sure you get a good shot on every possession, and, and we'll be all right. Um, and really, truthfully, the, the turnovers were the only thing that, you know, kept us from having a really like a, um, a complete control against the zone. Finally, you look at it, four and three right now. I mean, we're over a third of the way through the, the CAA. Your team four and three, two and two on the road. What does that say about your team? Um, you know, like we've talked about before, Chris, it's just, it's, it's just about getting better every day. You know, being steady, um, there are things we can improve on from today's game. What I love is that this team, like we kind of leaned in this week to like, hey man, this is everybody all in. Everybody. Whether you're a, a, a red shirt, you're a walk-on, you're a star, you're a starter, you're a reserve, you're not sure where you are right now, you're a manager, everybody's in. We're all in, we're leaning into it and enjoying it because that's what you experience, that, that's what you see. That's what you see is the joy of basketball when everybody's all in and that's, and that's what we had. So, hey, we're gonna still have ups and downs, there's gonna be tough games and all that kind of stuff, but that mentality is gonna take us where we're trying to get to. It's, that was a mentality where we finished last year. That's where we need to be, and I just can't. I'm just very proud of, of the group for all the contribution and energy going in the, in the direction today.